They are teaching compassion. They're teaching love. I'm Diana Cooper and I work with the angels. I've now written 27 books including five books for children and the angels absolutely are threaded throughout them and the unicorns of course because unicorns help children so much. One day I was walking in the woods and I was thinking about my granddaughter who finds life very difficult and I said to the angels, well, can you help me? What can I do to help her? And then this idea for a children's book called Tara and Her Magical Talking Kitten just was dropped into my head. And I ran home and I started writing the series that I'm now aiming to get onto a television series to help children. I really, really hope this will make a difference to children everywhere. There are all kinds of different children coming in. Many people have heard of the indigos, the crystals and rainbow children. They're very special. They all come in already enlightened. They come from Orion, which is the planet of wisdom and enlightenment. And coming from there, they carry wisdom in their auras. So, a vast, vast number of children are coming in with service in their energy fields, ready to help make this vast, enormous shift that we're going through to the new golden age starting in 2032. More and more high frequency children are coming in. The original ones have paved the way. So people are starting to say, clearly, we're not serving our children. We need to do it differently. And so the new children are preparing us to be ready for the new golden age. These children are teaching us about the wonder of being on earth. And that's truly an amazing lesson. And so it's not just about teaching children to do things that will earn them money and contribute to society. It's about helping them to express themselves, their creativity, their artistic energy. And I found that so interesting. Children teach us all the time. We are incredibly lucky. You have chosen a really, really important task in this process that's taking place now. So give yourself a pat on the back and say, wow, it might be difficult, but I'm really doing an important job here.